And Spectrum of Solutions and Permia Care work together to host their first Texas Intellectual Development Disability Summit today. Hunter Halcacer has more on what the summit was all about. The summit is meant to help bring awareness to the IDD community in the Permian Basin and where families can get help. More and more what you run into uh, is individuals who might have a child or a loved one who has these uh, diagnoses of spina bifida or Down syndrome, they don't know where to go. We want them to know that Permia Care is the local authority for these matters, that if you call us, we have government programs that can help you identify where you need to be. With state legislators like Tom Craddock, Brooks Landgraf, and Kevin Sparks in attendance at the summit, Permia Care and Spectrum of Solutions made sure to make it known what they were wanting out of the next legislative session, specifically an increase of the wages of group home direct care workers. Well, well, services for individuals with IDD are funded by Medicaid waiver programs. Uh, they're called Home and Community-Based Services or Texas Home Living Waiver. Those programs have an embedded rate of $10.60 an hour for the individuals that provide those services. And that is the funding that us and Spectrum of Solutions received today. And one of the things that we're trying to do uh, in the next legislative session is have that push to $15, $17 an hour. All three legislators in attendance spoke at the summit and showed their support for the wage increases, as well as reminding all in the room that there is support for the cause of doing more for the IDD community at the Capitol. I think it's a huge issue, and you know, I don't know if you know, but we just created two new hospitals in this area for behavioral health and they're getting we're going to break ground for the road in just a few minutes after this and uh, they're already under construction and it's a huge need in all of texas but particularly in west texas the next state legislative session will start on january 11th 2025 in midland for news west nine i'm hunter alcacer